hello people welcome to my youtube channel in this video we'll going to discuss about how to create a proper folder structure for output job file so as you can see here this is a my project of stm blue pill and if i'll go to the output job file there you can see these are the output generated in a proper folder manner so these are the 3d print assembly drawing 3d pdf schematic so these are all in uh, different folders as you can see the bomb the step file of the PCB the Gerber and NCDL files so how you can set up uh, your output job file so these folders will be auto generated so I'm going to discuss all these things in this video but before that if you guys want to win a $5 right now just follow these things what you guys need to do just go to the description of this video and they will find a link uh, free $5 registration link and you have to just left click on that link it will direct you to next PCB website there you have to register yourself with your official mail ID and sign up for uh, the next PCB.com and there you will find a coupon under my coupon section which will give you a $5 flat discount on your any PCB you order so here I'm using STM blue pill as a sample project and I'm just going to add two different output job files so I can show you guys what what are the difference between the folder structures job file and the normal uh, default job file so again add new to the project and add output job file add new to the project and output job file now i'm going to save those job file using uh, the with folder structure and one will be without structure save now I'm just going to generate firstly for without folder structure so I'm just going to add few things uh, so let's add a 3d PDF the schematic file and uh, you can add this document add assembly drawing now i'm just going to add few fabrication output the gerber file and ncdl files like this now i'm just going to add the bill of material for project uh, select all the pdfs now select all the non pdf files so here i'm just going to generate the uh, the output job output uh, of uh, without folder structure so firstly for uh, generate for the pdfs and then generate for the non pdf documents now i can open the uh, the project file and here you can see in output all things are mixed up right all things are coming together and it is not in proper structure so for big project it is very difficult to uh, like select each and file just categorize all the all, all of these on different folder so that is a kind of effort from user side so we, how we can uh, generate the separate folder so I'm just going to double click on with folder structure and here uh, before going further I'm just going to add again those files that we have added on previous document add schematic so just change it to project file uh, we have added assembly drawing we have we're going to add the Gerber and NCDL and bill of material that's it so now select all of these for PDFs for folder now we'll go to this option change left click on it and here we have to change this information like this and click on the separate file for each output with output name done so as you can see all pdfs are divided into their different category as you can see these are all the folder structure right click on ok similarly select the folder structure left click on change and there you have to select the ok this is good and here you have to select okay these are also fine 
and here you have to select manually managed and the path will be the output for uh, output of all the structure it will be directly created on the project output file okay that is good now okay now we're going to generate all these files before that i'm just going to delete those so you can easily see what what is the difference between the folder structure and non and normal default structure so generate content similarly generate all the pdfs close it go to the folder structure output of file and here you can see all are all of these are generated in a folder structure these are all the pdfs these are all the non pdfs so bomb is not generated because uh, i have not configured it but if i'll configure it will be generated so these are all mcd and gobo files and in pdf you can see the schematic and 3d pdf and all the pdfs are there so you can use this folder structure to optimize the output of your project file thank you so much